What up, what up? It's your boy, Young Jizzle. Nigga, y'all know what it is, man. DJ Dells, straight from the street, nigga. Huh? Like myself, nigga. I'm an addict for snitches. Addict for snitches. Addict for snitches. Addict for What's cool, what's good, back up in the building, it's your boy DJ Dells, back with a brand new episode here at the Sneak Erratic Show, brand new pick one, triple threat match, we've got the three Air Jordan 6s that released this year in shades of red, I kept asking my opinion, Dells, how do you feel about Jordan Brand giving us all these Jordan 6s in different shades of red? My opinion is, I'm fine with it. I love the Jordan 6, and besides that, it's not like they were all general releases. They were all very, very limited shoes. They weren't shoes that you could just go to your local mall and pick up just like that, bang, you were able to pick them up. It was tough to get all of them. I was able to get all three. They also were very different concepts. They definitely were very different, and I'm gonna break them down real quick one by one. Starting with these right here, we'll get up close, the infrared, 23s, really, really nice shoe. Very, very tough to get. Shoe is basically a reverse of the infrared six right here. The black infrared is my favorite sneaker of all times. Not my favorite Jordan, but my favorite sneaker of all times. So I really was digging this concept. The quality of this shoe is very nice. As you can see the leather up close, you see you got a combination of tumbled leather and a full grain leather. Very nice pair of kicks right here. Definitely a pain in the ass to get. I have a pretty interesting story on getting these. I think you should check out the review if you are interested in hearing that. You're gonna enjoy it. It's kinda entertaining. Check it out, I'll put a link in the description box below. But don't go yet, because we gotta keep it going. As you can see here, we've got the Spizike 6. This was to celebrate the Spizike anniversary. This shoe, I feel, was so hot in my opinion. I had to have it. I'm a big fan of the 6, as I keep telling you, but I really love the Spizike 2. I've done a ton of reviews on this channel on the Spizike, breaking them down, and just thought they did a great job. Leather on these, look at that leather. Real, real nice. See right there? That tumbled leather is just so sweet. And the interior is really nice too. And the hits of green remind me of the Big Apple, which I love being that I'm a New Yorker. Big fan of these, really, really hot. And last but not least, we got the Slam Dunk 6. Now this shoe right here, I thought concept wise was so dope being that Jordan brand kind of went out of the box. Notice that Slam Dunk, Definitely showed a lot of love to Jordan Brand throughout the years being that the main character was wearing Air Jordan 6's So they put out this shoe to celebrate Slam Dunk. Slam Dunk is from the 90's for people that do not know And it was very very popular Some heads did not like this shoe. They thought it was kind of tacky because of all the different artwork all over the shoe And I feel like the people that felt that way did not know about Slam Dunk and that's okay if you don't know about Slam Dunk, I mean, you may not be into that kind of stuff, but I suggest you checking that out and then coming back and looking at the review. And I guarantee you, you will appreciate the fact that Jordan Brand went out of the box and actually did something different. So definitely check that out. Look in the description box below when this episode's over though. Don't leave yet, because I'm about to show you them on feet in a second. Of course, I don't have three legs. So what I'm going to do is being that they came out in all different seasons, these came out in the fall, so I grabbed the on foot look in the fall weather, the one that I gave you guys already. These came out in the summertime, I'm wearing shorts, but you'll get that whole feel when you see the on foot with these. And these came out in the winter time where there was actually snow. So what I did was I basically gave you like a little mix that you're gonna watch, which I'm gonna hit you with in a minute, and I'll basically just show you the different looks of the shoes on foot, just to help you with your decision. And it's pretty dope because you'll get to see the different seasons. You'll be seeing me wearing these and there's actually snow on the floor. You'll see me wearing the Spiz Ikes with shorts and you'll see me wearing the Slam Dunks with some camos. I'm pretty sure I'm wearing camos with those. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Hit the like button if you did. Let me know that you enjoy watching. People out there, if you love the show, just show that love. That's all I need. Just that love, support, lets me know. 
Leave them comments, participate, pick one, leave your thoughts. Doesn't matter what he like, what she like, it's all about what you like. So leave your comments after you see the on foot, unless you already know which one you like the best. Matter of fact, list it one through three. One being your favorite, three being your least favorite. Share this Facebook, Twitter, Google+, Plus. let your friends and family know about the show. And thank you for watching. Go to the blog too, thesneakerattic.com for your sneaker news. Updated 24-7, sneaker news on a regular basis, only what's hot, and I also put information up on any restock information I hear to help everyone out. Let's show them more feet now. DJ Dell, you know I love you, love you, love you. Hate is just mad that we win in this plans. More status, y'all just follow commands. Young rich and just don't give a damn. No new friends, all about the Benjis and fam. Rich and old like Adidas. Top tens be the meanest. Wait me since the feed is big ego, I'm conceited. I don't give a fuck about you or your weak crew. Talking all that rah rah till you see us come through. Then you're quiet, not a sound or an action. Trolling online, but a personal reaction. I don't care what you say, I'm doing me. Bigger threat, DJ Dell's free max B. I don't care what you want, care what you need, care who you with, care who you been doing me, huh? me, doing me. DJ Dell, you got love You got some neighbors around you like to talk a lot. Smile, say how you doing, but when you off the block, they the ones talking shit about you. Some will even rap to pigs about you. But for the most part, Got a problem, just holler, you good It's a beautiful day on the block Chillin' crackin' jokes, keep the youngest taking notes Classic Snoop blasting out the window Talk about drinking gin, smoking in dope Pretty thing next door, fat ass, nice rack At the barbecue tonight, I gotta beg It's a beautiful day in my neighborhood My homies getting paid in my neighborhood Sunshine bright on my neighborhood